Hi, this is uh, my copy of Home Designer Pro 2018. And just like I said, I'm going to go to the Edit menu, Default Settings, Wall, Edit, and then here's the walls. One for exterior and one for interior. Let's see, I believe you asked. Besides that to no avail. Well, all I can say is that's a, that's a flunk. It was very straightforward and my directions were exact. Okay. Let's see. Try that no avail. Additionally, I have to set the wall par parameters like thickness. Okay, let me under bring you up to date on this. I have the drop down here for different types of walls that are preset in suite. In more expensive applications you have more choices in suite you have what you have. And okay. I don't know what the blankety blank blank you kind of wall you want, but you know there's all kinds of walls in here that you can set. Now the other thing I was talking about Let's say you picked, uh, let's go to back here, walls, and let's say you used ICF siding. Okay, now I'm going to click on the, a wall, a, an exterior tool, and there's an ICF siding wall. I'm going to open the dialog box, and you can see it has this kind of siding on it. Maybe that's not the kind of siding you want. Let's get a camera view. Yeah, so there's the exterior side and, and the interior side on the other on the other side. Now I'm going to use this tool here called the Adjust Material Definition Tool, our tricolor, and we'll click on that. And now using this dialog, <coughs> you can change the exterior color. Okay. The choices in here are limited, but you can make some changes. Um, but if you want more choices, then you need to, you should have bought Home Designer Pro, and, and that, that's not my responsibility, but you bought Sweet, which is very limited in what you can do with it. If you don't like that, well, I don't care. But what else can we do with this? Like in other versions, you can just open this dialog box and then define the parameters of this wall. In Suite, you don't have the choice. You have these preset wall types, and that's it. You can't alter them except for, for the surface material. And uh, if you wanted more choices, then you, you shouldn't have bought Suite. Home Designer Pro would let you do that. Let me show you. I'm going to open Home Designer Pro 2018, which, in my opinion, is the only uh, worthwhile Home Designer Pro, t I mean, a Home Designer uh, title to buy. <coughs> okay, I'm just going to open a new plan, and we'll just go to uh, Walls, and I'll show you what the difference is. Okay, there's a siding six wall. Now I can alter this wall type by going to uh, wall types, and then I can define and change each layer of this of this wall and the relative thickness and so forth. It's very easy to do because it's facilitated. You pay the extra money for that extra facility. <coughs> and if I wanted uh, this. Be the, just as I described before, you go to Edit Default Settings Walls, Exterior Wall, and then you, you can go to Wall Types and change the, the exterior wall type, and, and you can then define that wall type, change its thickness and layers and so forth to suit your purposes. Sweet so doesn't do that. It never did that, never will do that. Home Designer Pro does.
So read them in the week. That's the way the cow eats the cabbage around here. So thanks for watching. Hope this helps straighten out your understanding.